Baba Booey. WestJet. What is up, key cards at re... <clears throat> My name is WestJet, and today we're going to be doing what your favorite fan of Skid says about you. Oh, and literally, super sad you're subscribed. So be sure to subscribe. Yeah, yeah. Mom revealed for her. Okay, she's my mom. If you like this skin, you're an NPC. Let me change the music. Ah, much better. You spent all your money on child support and can't even afford the blue Oni Phantom. Unfortunate. You're like that dumbass hedgehog from Ice Age, the one that cracked the whole- Never mind. Damn! Instead of finding normal Christmas presents under your tree, you found your dad passed out in a pool of vomit with a meth pipe next to him. Not talking from personal experience, by the way. Now, let's say hypothetically I was, I would make sure that... This video is sponsored by Opera GX, the best browser for gamers. And you know it's for gamers, because you can force dark pages onto anything. Wow. Not to mention, you can directly adjust your RAM usage, as well as your CPU limiter. Limit the amount of CPU that Opera uses directly. Pretty cool. One of Opera GX's coolest features is the sign. Oh, and Twitch is directly built in, so you can watch your favorite streamers, like my boy Ninja Blevins. I'm not seeing enough food! And Discord is directly built in, so you can start e-dating right away. Not convinced? Maybe you're broke? No worries, it's free. Runs well, and doesn't blow up your PC. Google Chrome be like. Another wonderful feature of Opera GX is the network limiter. You're able to directly limit the amount of bandwidth for video streaming. Great. Opera also got this cool feature top left called GX Corner. This is nice because it shows you the release of new games and offers you free ones as well. You can even use it to see my uploads. What a win for you. Thank you, Opera, for sponsoring this video. Download link in the description and pinned comment. You don't exist. Nobody owns this skin. Nobody likes this skin. I have never seen anybody use it. And the day I do is the day I stop playing. When you were a kid, you were diagnosed with autism and you had to color those books. You know what I mean? I mean, guys, let's be honest. It's in the name. Glitch Pop. There's so much soda in your blood. You're developing a new diabetes. Type 7. Speaking of 7, you're probably 7 years old and the taste buds of your eyes haven't developed yet. How are you gonna call a skin the Infinity Phantom and give it a finite amount of bullets? Brain dead game. You are essentially Iron Man. Your rank anyway. Well, at least you think you are. Iron Man was rich, good looking, had friends. You have two hobbies in life. NFTs and trafficking humans. The only light in your life is the Zippo under your meth pipe. You're an Elon Musk fanboy and probably would get bullied by uh, our bald friend. Let me get my little plug and plug it in. Maybe I can get an erection one day. Uh there is a 99% chance you're a conspiracy theorist or at least watch a little Alex Jones on the side. I'm kind of retarded. <laughs> Alex Jones, how dare you slur on my video? It might offend somebody. Uh, nevertheless, uh, Oni Phantom, um, yeah, you're cool. Bit of a normie, you follow trends, but yeah, cool. Okay, this is unrelated to the video. I just wanted to say, if you've ever been genuinely offended by something somebody told you in a video game, go outside, please, for your own safety. Fun fact, this Phantom actually got copyrighted by Jeff Bezos, because, you know, he owns the trademark for Prime. Nevertheless, I'm a huge fan of Jeff and the way he exploited millions of people to become a billionaire. You're a Nats fan and physically are incapable of making your own opinion about skins. Disastrous. You have nobody to talk to other than this skin and the voices in your head. There are bugs in your skin. You want to peel it off. There are bugs. You are gold in Valorant and despite that undeniable fact, having a radiant on the name of the skin makes you feel better. Copium. I don't know if a lot of you guys know this, but the Valorant content creator who plays Phoenix, XTR, is actually in the US Army, and I was talking to him. I was like, oh, you get any kills? And he said he got a couple in multiple different rounds. While we're out here playing cartoony, kid-friendly game Valorant, he's playing CSGO. Just like myself, you got ADHD, you like to click around, you like to press tab a lot while you're in-game, you know, you like medication, you like, uh, stimulants. You stand a long time in the Walmart section looking at their guns for no particular reason, you're just admiring the craftsmanship. You just want a sweet, sweet taste of that Asimov from Counter-Strike, honestly, iconic skins. Other than pyramids and sarcophaguses, what is in Egypt? Gen genuinely, please tell me. You know, I would say you're like Shrek, but Shrek's actually pretty cool and based. In reality, you're everything that Shrek stands for without his funny personality. You're just an ogre. Ah, so you're like the troll from Harry Potter. Sorry, guys, I have to increase my female viewership here. Yellow tape around his
Let's make it a hundred. <laughs> you are probably homophobic. You're a really cool guy. You got Lego in your room. You got a 3D printer. You're into science. Just everything women find insanely attractive. You're also a globe tard. You're essentially a modern day philosopher, god, genius, icon, tank, specimen, unit. You're essentially not a modern day philosopher, god, genius. Oh, you boys already know how I feel about Zed, the most overrated artist in all of history. If I ever see him in TwitchCon, I'll smile and take a photo with him. You like to get stepped on. You're the type of dude to go into a fight and say, pick on someone your own size. You're a Phoenix main. If you aren't, ooh, I got news for you. You might have a little bit of an undiagnosed brain tumor. You only like the skin so you can appease the Chinese overlords and raise your social credit. And his name is Zhao Xina. <laughs> You know, the name of this skin is very fitting, because you, as well, spend all your time in the Undercity, World of Warcraft. Another fun tip in bullying somebody, you can call them a World of Warcraft virgin if they're pissing you off. It works every time. Even if you're both playing Valorant, just call them that. It'll set them off. You're the guy. You're the guy from Despicable Me 2 that helps Gru with his army of slaves. You're the best around. Nothing's gonna ever keep you down. 10k likes on the video and I'll do a new house reveal. To class you stay cool and don't be a fool. Let's go! Cause I'm feeling like I'm running and I'm feeling like I gotta get away, get away, get away. Better know that I don't and I